with a little bit of static due to my old headphones, but I can hear you. Good. Now, listen carefully. You are in front of one of the back entrances to the Hexagon. The staff here use a special secure digital card to access the place. You will find one in the back alley inside oh. a metallic box. Okay, I can move. Uh, let's see. No. Where's the metallo boxo? Hey, it's uh, the Arcadia Six sign with all your names written on it. How did you manage to get your hands on this card? That was a combination of social engineering, months of decrypting code, and a bit of pure luck. We were saving it for a special occasion, but what better day than today? Well, what about Boxing Day? What about Independence Day? That seems kind of fitting. going to find Trevor's location then we have added some extras to your SD card one of them is some homebrew software that can be used to reverse engineer level access devices I also threw in my ROM hack of Metroid Ah, evil offices right out of Blade Runner, just the way Mom made them. Okay, so that's the diamond. Uh, I do not have access to that. All right. Let's take the geometry test. Apparently the Arcadia control grid is right there. And there's just a hallway, no door. Do not go in there yet, Kovacs. It cannot be that easy. I see a machine on the other side of this glass. I believe it has a rhombus symbol on it. Must be an access level device. Make sure you get there. Copy. Uh, my phone is vibrating. Remember I mentioned those extras we added to your SD card? That is a proximity sensor detector. This tool works like a... like a Geiger counter. Whenever you are close to a proximity sensor, that bar will rise. So tread lightly. And if you see that red bar rising, you would better move back. Oh boy, it's one of these now. All right, can't get in there yet. I have to raise my access level to enter this door. All right. Can't go through there. I'm genuinely being quiet, like I'm actually gonna set this sensor off, <laughs> like... <laughs> Hello. My old friend, the vent. Oh, damn it. 
Do I really have to get inside that vent? Looks like it. But I can't look at my phone in here. How the hell am I going to avoid those sensors? Try to guide yourself with the sound, Kovacs. Nope. Okay. I can feel it vibrating on my controller, too, so... Then again, considering I hold my controller right underneath my microphone, I get the feeling you guys have been hearing a lot of that, uh, especially the clicking of my joystick. So, sorry if that's annoying. Did I just go in a circle? Okay, I did not just go in a circle. Nope, nope, nope. I don't see any cameras in here. Weird. And you will not see them. Our intel says they do not have cameras in the hexagon. We do not know the reason for this. One comes to mind. Oh, what I just went in a big here? goddamn circle. Okay. This kind of reminds me of that game uh, for the Saturn, uh, Enemy Zero, where it kind of played with uh, a sound sensor. If you guys uh, haven't played that, I highly recommend it. Easy now, Kovacs. Dot the I's and cross the T's. Okay. What? Th that door has a timer? Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, I can't believe it. I gotta go back. Uh, what kind of moron puts a timer on an automatic door? Sadistic well, game designers. Every automatic door has a timer. Okay, I just gotta kinda zigzag it. All right. Go, 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 go. Ugh. Ah, finally, I'm inside. Now I can finally make photocopies. <laughs> oh, Trevor, I'm gonna help you out, buddy. I can't do it. Someone must have left their axis lying around. Uh, what about this guy? Oh, there we go. Now you will have to manually transfer the permission info from the machine to your phone. Sounds easy, but how do I do that? to press buttons to swap the positions of the two geometric shapes. It is not that difficult. Oh boy, it's one of these. All right. I can't even do the uh, the sliding puzzle in a Resident Evil game. How the hell am I going to do this? Level. Okay, jeez. All right. I'm enjoying doing my bit to wipe that creepy smile off her face. Is that In a In light of the dissemination of the unauthorized images of the citizen of Arcadia, Trevor Hills, Walton Media feels compelled to issue this statement. We categorically deny all information that has been made public about the circumstances surrounding Trevor Hills' so-called escape. Such information, which is clearly intended to damage Walton Media's good reputation, lacks the slightest hint of veracity. I mean, what is murder Walton anyway? Media and the American Arcadia team have taken every measure to ensure Mr. Hill's physical well-being. Tomorrow at 8 p.m., there will be an official live appearance clarifying everything that happened regarding the behavior of our citizen. 
This appearance will include the testimony of Trevor Hills himself. Thank you. Wait, Trevor Hills himself? W what is she planning, to wipe his brain clean? You can expect anything from Vivian. I detest her, but I have to admit that wretched woman is shrewd and cunning like no other. And incredibly oh, sexy. Number six? What's happening? Damn it, guys, they're down here. We need to go, now! Kovacs, they found us. What? Who? Bolton Media's goons, of course. They must be tracking us somehow. Everybody gear up, because we are out in five! Listen, we have to go now. I will get in touch with you again as soon as we reach a safe spot. Okay, okay. Kovacs, find Trevor and get him out. Guys, make sure we leave no trail behind us. From now on, you are on your own. We are counting on you. Stay safe, number six, and good luck. Good luck to you too, Kovacs. Number six. You were number one in my book. And that you were piss instead of shit. I'm clever. Uh, pick up the pace, Angelino. You guys can't see this, but I am moving as fast as I can. It's just like, sister, your friend is in danger. Pick up the pace. All right, got to get my hexagon on. Oh, no, that's a pentagon. <laughs> oh, no, that's the other one. That's the other secret government building I'll be damned in a geometrically shaped building I'm literally scared shitless okay not literally I don't know about you but I'm up for some more vent crawling Oh, knees. Ooh, looks like I got inside the Walton Media Illuminati meeting. And look who's here. Hello, my fellow American Arcadia teammates. It is so good to see all of you here. Hello, Except Hello Debbie. Vivian. First of all, we know that whatever happens tomorrow is going to be crucial to the future of Walton Media and American Arcadia. So... My thanks and appreciation to every single one of you for your commitment. No, thank you, Vivian. Pathetic. Oh. You're too kind, Kendra. Oh, Kendra, that I suck up! <laughs> On a different note, I've talked with Trevor and I'm convinced he'll come to his senses. Sooner than later, I hope. And once he signs, we'll bring him to a realignment booth and everything will be ready. Realignment booth? Until then, let's stay in high spirits with a positive attitude and everything will go smoothly. Am I right or am I right? Of course, baby! See you tomorrow then. And remember, teamwork makes Damn the it. dream work. Number six was right. I don't know what a realignment booth is, but it reeks of brainwashing. Or maybe it's just realigning his spine. Did you ever think of that? Okay, can everyone stop talking? You're driving me insane. Before Trevor signs anything. Ah, this game is a fucking cacophony sometimes. The access level device is right there. Good. And here's another stupid puzzle I can't figure out. Access level All right. Operated. New level, Pentagon. No, 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 no. I don't want to touch anything in here besides what's strictly necessary. Oh, come on. I got it. <laughs> all these infuriating puzzles. I'm going to boop all the buttons that I want. Uh, figuring out how to, like, jump on a thing and to another thing, I can do that no problem, but sliding a thing to another thing, out of the fucking question. Ah, what the hell. Shit. Interceptors. I'm telling you, he might look like he's 80, but this guy runs as if his life depended on it. Well, that kind of makes sense. All night long, playing hide and seek in the wetlands. Dan broke a leg chasing that asshole. Really? Man, that's bad. And that's terrible. Kovacs? Kovacs, do you copy? Number six. What happened? 
Did you make it to the safe house? Take the next exit right, number four. Not yet, we're still on the road, but I think we lost them. For now. Any news from Trevor? Yeah, but not good news. You're right. About everything. We have to hurry. We must anticipate and maybe... Maybe carry out a really bold move. Bathe them in barbecue sauce and hang them upside it? down. There is no time now. Focus on entering the Arcadia Control Grid, Kovacs. That hall is plagued with infrared beams. Hmm, not good. Do you see a way to shut them down? Uh, there is a device in here. Let me try. Have you tried kicking the plug out? Have you tried turning it off then on oh, again? You gotta be kidding me. The device to shut the beams down is an hexagon level? What do I do? We cannot wait anymore, Kovacs. Memorize the position of the beams and try to- Reenact the laser scene from Ocean's 12. You were gonna say that, right? Uh, sort of, but without the pop culture reference. Okay, shooting all this with my phone. All right, here goes nothing. Nope. <laughs> okay, I was looking at that the wrong way because uh, if you look in here, yeah, look at that. Look on the monitors. They are facing the opposite direction. So I was doing this completely wrong. Yeah, I got to go down dead center. Then hug the wall. Then go to the right. Then go to the left. So, okay, center. Center, right, left, right. One more time. Let's see, center, left, right, left. Okay, center, left, right, left. Center, left, right, left. Nope! <laughs> I'm all turned around spatially in this place. I made it. You are now in the Arcadia control grid. Every critical system of the city runs through these servers. Including that vending machine that has the M&Ms we like. Off if I knew how to. Me too. But since we do not know how to do that, we should use it to our advantage and find Trevor. A really simple wiring, that's all. I only have to keep track of the yellow cable. I'll take a picture of it just in case. Oh boy. No! I can't believe this machine is also a hexagon level! Oh, thank God. There's one of those access level devices in here. How does this thing work now? Access level upgraded. All right, finally. New level. Hexagon. I'm having a puzzle okay. overload. Arcadia control grid. Help me find my good friend, Trevor Clarence Hills. AKA Arcadia's public enemy number one. AKA 10392. 372 cameras? Really? Oh, looks like this is gonna take a while, number six. Do you have time now to explain that really bold move you were talking about? Yes. Once you locate Trevor, get him to. You know where old Arcadia is, right? 
The abandoned prototype town? Why do you want me to bring Trevor there? Spruce it up. Flip the place. Workshop is. And since we know they stole his technology for the jingle, we need to use it to get it out of Trevor's head. <laughs> what? Removing the jingle? Are you crazy? Th th that plan is like a hundred to one shot, to put it mildly. We barely know anything about the jingle. Except that it's catchy as hell. You need to get inside realignment and find as much information as you can. But only after you bring to <sighs> Number four, I told you to slow down, damn it. S stop the car and act casual when the cop comes. Get rid of the joint! <laughs> please, please, trust me. Bring Trevor to old Arcadia. We were hotboxing it while we were trying to escape the cops. <laughs> there he is! Oh, finally. No, 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 Trevor, don't do it. Don't sign that! Comms were locked, so the only way I found to communicate with him was to play an audio file from my phone. And guess what song was the first one in my recently played files? Andrew Kovacs? Is that you? Oh. Thank you, okay. suspiciously appropriate and song. How do I get a brand new start? Got it. Although I don't think I'm going to be able to keep doing this using only verses of that stupid song. Not until the remix, anyway. Ah, oh, finally, I farted in there and it was getting real musty. Okay, we're heading into another love area. Um, I'm gonna call this episode here because, frankly, I'm really exhausted by all the puzzles and I need to uh, realign. I need to do my own little realignment. Ah, see everything tied together nicely. All right. Thanks a lot for watching. Uh, we'll pick up right from here when the next episode starts. See you then.